hello guys welcome back to my channel if you are old here thanks and if you are new here please kindly subscribe and turn on the notification bell so that you get notified anytime i upload a new video in this tutorial i'm going to show you how to design a flyer like this using adobe photoshop without any further ado let's get started then go to your file select new then here i'm going to use 1080 by 1080 this is for social media or for printing then i'm going to use cmyk color code then because this is for printing all right not actually i'm not going to print it but to show you how to design something like this then this is the color code i'm going to use i'm going to copy it ctrl plus c then go to your solid color and ctrl plus v to paste okay now we are going to our resource file now then i'm going to import this image here then drag it up then just increase it a little now change the blending mode to multiply reduce the opacity to 22 then go back and import this image here then take it up all right then change the blending mode to color dodge then apply your layer mask and blend it Then go back again to your resource file and I'm going to import this image here. Then position it this way. Okay. Then go to your blending mode. Then change it to color dodge. apply your layer mask and blend it then i'm going to change this one to multiply then reduce the opacity to 19 percent Then it's okay like this. Then import this brush, drag it down, then position it around here. It's okay. Select your test tool, change the font to Ganymedia, then copy the church name ctrl plus v to paste then change the font color to white increase the font size so you can add church logo to to your own but in this tutorial today i'm not adding church logo so if you want to design it then you can add your own church logo then go back to your test document to copy your test ctrl plus c to copy then duplicate this one drag it down and highlight it ctrl plus a to highlight then ctrl plus v to paste now reduce the size of the font then increase the character spacing to open it reduce the size ctrl plus a to select all then apply vertical alignment to centralize it then ctrl plus d to deselect
Now I'm going to copy this one, Ctrl plus C to copy. Select your test tool. The Ctrl plus V to paste. Now I'm going to close the crater spacing to 0%. Then change the font to the Jacqueline. And over here I'm going to copy this color code for the test. Then change the font color. Ctrl plus V to paste. Increase the size. Then I'm going to apply a drop shadow. Then change the blending mode to multiply then the opacity 100 percent the distance 5 then the spread the spread 4 and the size 4 click ok Select your test tool. Then I'm going to type of the letter, the words of. Then go to your font. Then I'm going to change it to this font here, Akira Expanded. Then drag this layer style over it. Then come over to your test and I'm going to copy this one. Select your test tool. Then close the character spacing to 0%. Then I'm using the same font Akira Expanded. Now increase the font size. Then centralize it like this. I'm going to leave it this way. Then apply vertical alignment to centralize it. Then I'll position this one over here. And this one, I will position it around here. Then drag the layer style to it. So when you are dragging the layer style, make sure that you hold your Alt key. That is to copy and paste. Then I'm going to copy this one. Ctrl plus C to copy. Then go back to my resource file and I'm going to import this image over here disclaimer this image is for tutorial purpose only so nothing else such program is not holding anywhere so this is for tutorial purpose only then i'm going to draw a wrench angle
all right then i'm going to reduce the opacity to 58 something like this okay then i will draw another rectangle at the top here leave it at white color then apply a corner shape only for the top that's the 30% so I may also reduce it then go back I'm going to adjust it I will make use of 20 then I'm going to remove this 13 percent let it be 20 by 20 percent so okay like this then select your test tool now change the font to open sans or i'm going to make use of this uh, chisel reduce the font size then drag it over here then go back to your font color and I'm going to change the color to black then reduce the rent angle Then reposition the test using your arrow key. Copy the name. Select your test tool. Ctrl plus V to paste. Change the font color to white. Then hold your shift key while you reduce the rent angle. Okay. Now we are going to date and time now. Ctrl plus C to copy. So what I did is to duplicate it. Increase the size. Then select the test tool. I like this one. And uh, apply superscript. Then change the font to Ganymedia. Then I'm going to import the calendar icon, reduce the size. Then align it. Ensure that it is straight. The control plus U or control plus I to invert the color. then click ok to apply white background color on the icon ctrl plus c to copy select your test tool Ctrl plus V to paste. Aligned the test. Then 
then adjust it by using your arrow key then ctrl plus c to copy the time import the time icon reduce the size drag it over here and align it with the other icon then drag it over here so to do this press ctrl plus u that is for hue and saturation so duplicate this 10 and drag it over here then highlight it ctrl plus a and ctrl plus v to paste okay i'm coming over to change that am to pm ctrl plus c to copy this one then import the location icon reduce the size then ensure that is it is aligned with the other so you can see the sign of alignment then when you are moving it or taking any action then you will see a line that is appearing there so that is an alignment um guideline so change the font and uh, make it bold Ctrl plus V to paste. Then here we are going to reduce the space so that the test will come together. So like this, eight percent. Now reduce the font size. Then position it around here. Increase it more. It's okay. So, if you are not subscribed yet, please kindly subscribe and turn on the notification bell. Apply vertical alignment to centralize it. If you need of if you need of any of my flyer please you can check the link in the description then go to my father account to make your order now so now i have changed it to pm and if you want to optimize your video i have a two body link in the description you can kindly go there register and optimize your video thank you so much please remember to subscribe and turn on the notification bell so that is the end of the video. Thank you so much.